scientists are using the latest technology to hunt for the cause of ship sinking rogue waves. New research suggests that some of these monsters form in storm systems. I guarantee you there's such thing and they're out there and they want to take your soul. But mysteriously, there are stories of some rogues appearing on clear days. And a recent incident that killed six people off the coast of Tofino, Canada, could provide valuable clues. The 65-foot Leviathan II was taking a small group on a whale-watching tour. It was a gorgeous day out uh, for the end of October. Very similar to a day like today, actually. Beautiful day to be out on the water. Dwayne Mazaru was on board when the ship got into trouble. This is what I remember. The waves kind of seem to come from all different directions out here. Yeah. Right? For the first time, Dwayne is visiting the exact location of the accident. So the day of the accident, we were on the other side of these, these rocks here. and. Uh, watching the sea lions from that side, watching in. Uh, we had turned around, and we're coming around that side of the, the reef there um, when we slowed down again. And that's when we were struck by a wave coming this way. Just toppled the boat over. Within a split second, I was underwater. Survivors described the wave towering over the 16-foot tall boat, a huge wave that came from nowhere. I was able to swim out from underneath the boat and surface. Um, it was just a, a kind of scene of chaos in the water. Everyone was in shock, including myself, and uh, just people in the water all over. The boat completely flipped upside down uh, next to us, and both screaming and panicking. The wave vanishes, leaving a trail of destruction. Duane is stranded in the frigid 57-degree water for around an hour. I don't think we would have lasted much longer in the water. Our legs were cramping up, and, and we were pretty much frozen solid. We had an idea that there was a good chance that we might not make it home that day. Duane and 20 others are rescued and taken to shore, but six lives are lost that day. It was definitely the most terrifying experience of my life. I've never been in a situation like that before and hope to never be again. It's chilling proof that rogues can occur in any weather. Going out on a whale watching boat seems like such an ordinary thing. The weather wasn't particularly bad. There were some waves and yet this incident happened that rolled the boat and led to fatalities. I think increasingly the understanding is that they don't need a storm to be created. Sailor stories often talk about a regular calm sea and suddenly the wall of water is there. 